Hi guys, today is the day after Christmas. It is Monday. I am off today, tomorrow, and Wednesday. Then I'm back to work on Thursday. So they usually have a ton of really good sales after Christmas. So I thought I would go to the mall, take you guys with me, see what we could find. Uh, for Christmas, I got a few gift cards and I did get a little bit of money. So I thought maybe I would go and put that towards something. Also, if you guys would be interested in seeing a what I got for Christmas video, let me know if you'd be interested and I can definitely film that for you so we are going to get going but let me share with you what I'm wearing today it is very very casual so let me share with, with you in this mirror so hold on okay here is my outfit today I am wearing these Kendra Scott earrings and the mirror is a little dirty I'm sorry about that I definitely need to clean it but I have Kendra Scott earrings I have this sweatshirt that I got from Lululemon on sale I have this puffer jacket it is a long oversized puffer jacket I got it mainly for when I go to my daughter's hockey games I want to say I got this from Zara I have just uh Spanx leggings I have adidas sneakers to be nice and comfy and you guys i have been loving this bag so much it's been really really cold here and i just feel like it goes with the weather and it's super comfortable to wear because it has a thick strap and it's easy to get into so i will do our usual what's in my bag when i get in the car but this is my outfit today for shopping as i stated super super casual super comfy and then i might add a pair of sunglasses let's see hold on let's see what sunglasses i'm gonna add today okay here are my sunglasses they are a little unorganized you'll have to excuse me i definitely need to find a better way to organize some my sunglasses but I think today I might wear these sunglasses these are my Chanel sunglasses and some wearing black and white this has like a white mother of pearl Chanel logo so I'll put these on and I'll show you what they look like but I definitely have to organize these a little better okay so here are my sunglasses I'm gonna go with these today and I have to show you okay I just clean my closet and I still have to, I want to kind of reorganize my closet a little bit, kind of, I definitely have to dust, but I tidied and it just feels so nice to tidy and have everything clean. So that is my closet right now. So we are ready to go and we get in the car. I'll share with you what's in my bag. How are you? I'm good. How are you today? I'm doing fabulous for a Monday after Christmas. How are you? <laughs> good. Thank you. What can I get started for you? Um, Can I please have a tall iced vanilla latte you sure can. um with one pump of vanilla and one stevia mm -hmm. and is it possible to get maybe a little more milk than coffee so since that's a latte it'd be kind of hard i mean we can dump half the shot out if you want but i wouldn't recommend that no okay you so put it you want to put it in a grande cup that would give you more milk yeah that would be great thank you, you it, son, right? yeah that would be awesome thank you one pump of vanilla, and then we're going to do... Oh, one stevia, please. I'm making it complicated. Sorry about that. No, that's more complicated the more we love you. <laughs> Under our sign, people don't realize it, but it's just, please bring complications here. <laughs> I'm sure you get a lot of those, too. We do. Yeah. And this is, it's iced, correct? Yes, please. Anything else for you today? No, nope, that'll be it. Thank you so much. All right, it's 5.04. We'll see you at the window. Okay, thanks. Oh, he feels so bad. He was so nice. Okay, so he gave it to me in a grande cup. Mm. So there's no, more milk. I like it this color. It's so good. Mm. Okay, let's go. Okay, it's going to be a little shaky, but I want to chat with you just for a little bit to tell you guys about our Christmas. We had such a nice Christmas. We woke up Christmas morning and Sky, she really, really had a great Christmas morning. And as parents, obviously, that's what you want to see. You want to see their faces. But the thing that made me so proud about her is even though she's an only child, she's not the type that just wants to like blow through presents. She loves to watch other people open presents. Like she was like, oh, daddy opened one or mommy opened one and it was really, really sweet. Now, Dave and I, we really make Christmas about Sky and the dog, of course. So we don't really get each other a ton of stuff for Christmas. We more so like to see the joy in her face and she was so excited because I think I mentioned in a prior vlog, 
I was gonna get her, or Santa was gonna get her, the Home Alone Lego set. Well, she has been loving Home Alone lately. Like, she's been watching that movie over and over. Who doesn't love Home Alone? And it's just so funny, because I watched that when I was younger, and now she loves it. But uh, today, her and my husband are both home, and I said, well, what are you guys gonna do today? And she's like, I just wanna stay home and build the Home Alone Lego set while I watch Home Alone. So that's what she is gonna do today. And then my husband, oh, sorry, hold on guys. Uh, so that's what she's gonna do today. Just stay home, build her Home Alone set. She'll, she'll, I'm guarantee you guys, she's so good at those. I don't, I don't mean to sound conceited because I know she's my kid, but she loves those Lego sets and she can just sit there for hours and put them together. So she's gonna do that today while watching Home Alone. So I was really happy she liked that. She got some hockey stuff, she got a jersey, a bunch of little stocking stuffers, but the Home Alone Lego set was her big present. So um, we did that and then we went to see my grandma. My grandma is 95 years old and it was so good to see her and spend time with her. And then we came home. Well, we came home late last night and I cleaned my closet, which it felt so nice because there were clothes everywhere, you guys. It was just such an, a mess. So I did that. So I'm kind of bummed because I didn't get to see the UPS and the FedEx guy before Christmas and they come to my house so frequently that I definitely got them a little something. I was torn on what to get them. Last year I got gift cards, but this year I just gave them cash. I don't know, my dad used to be a mailman and he said that, you know, that's what they like. They just like cash. So hopefully I'll see them sometime today so I can give them their holiday card. Um, what else? And yeah, we're just going to have some good family time, maybe see some movies. Maybe my husband and I are trying to think of something else fun to take her to do. Like, I don't know what, but we're going to try to figure it out. But today, for the next couple of hours, is a day of shopping. Let's see if we can get some sales. So, okay guys, I am going to check back in with you when I get to the mall. I'm going to give my mom a call. So, I will see you in a bit. Okay, so I was on E, so I had to stop and get gas, but this is a perfect opportunity to share with you what is in my Marc Jacobs tote. You guys, I have been loving this bag. I plan on doing a review to tell you the positives and negatives because I've worn it quite a bit, but it fits a lot. So let me share with you what I have in here. I'll do really quick while I'm getting gas. I have my little, oh, can you guys see okay? I hope you can. I have my little uh, pouch, my little key pouch that I got. Oh, okay, see, isn't it so pretty, the colors? Um, this is from the Room with a View collection. This is what I keep, like some cards, a little bit of cash, and my keys. I also have my little agenda. This is my little PM agenda, and I love this. I did a video on it in case you guys are interested, just kind of what's in here, but I already put in my 2023. Uh, you can see I have the 23 in here, and I love this. This is just like, you know, to keep like doctor's appointments, this guy's practices, that kind of stuff. So then I have my little small cosmetic pouch. This is where I have some cash and some receipts. Then I have my little card holder from the men's collection. This is where I have some gift cards in here. And then what else do I have? I also have, oh, I have two fragrances. I have Baccarat Rouge 540, which you guys, I, anytime I wear this, I get so many compliments. I definitely need to get some more of these little travel sizes. And then I also have a Clean Reserve Aqua Neroli. I really love this too, just a nice fresh scent. And then, do I have anything else? I have like a couple little like Bath and Body Works coupons. And yeah, and that's pretty much it. It can fit a lot more, but that's all I have in here. So I really, really have been loving it. It's perfect for this weather. Um, and it's just so comfortable to wear because of the strap. So, oh, okay, it's done. So, oh my gosh, that's good. I filled my tank for like 60 bucks. Normally it's close to 100. I'm actually very excited gas is going down. So, okay. That's what's in my bag. And I also wanna tell you guys about the medium that I went to the other day. So my neighbor had a party the other day with like 15 of us and she had a medium. And I don't know if you guys have ever been to a medium. I have been once before. So what she does is she doesn't necessarily see spirits but she kind of has a little pad and she scribbles on it, similar to Tyler Henry. If you guys have ever watched Tyler Henry, I really, really like him. But she can almost kind of communicate with them or like she like he 
hears things, I guess, or like they show her like symbols, something like that. But the majority of everybody had some at the party had someone come through and some of the stuff she said was really cool and it really really hit on I will be honest for me she did not um, I was hoping I like a couple people would come through but I didn't end up having anybody and then at the end she did say hey is there anyone that I missed or is there anyone that really wants to try to have someone come through and I did but everything everything she said was wrong so I kind of wish she would have just like ended there and say hey I'm just not seeing anybody because she was so good for the whole entire time we had her she hit on like everyone pretty much and she was there for like two hours but then for me she didn't and like I said I just kind of wish that she would have just said nope I'm not seeing anybody because she she kept kind of pushing it a little bit and I just didn't you know nothing she said like related to it so I don't know I I would say I am a believer but I'm also a little bit of a skeptic too because I haven't had anyone come through or anything like that but I would say you know I definitely you know you want to believe that when you know you pass away or a loved one passes away that you're going to be able to kind of communicate with them again and my husband was joking he was like oh don't worry if something happens to me you'll know it he's like I'm gonna haunt you and I was like don't do that it'll scare me he's like no he's like you know we have that joking type of relationship so that's what I'm gonna do I'm gonna come I'm gonna like drop things all sorts of things so anyway so it was fun it was fun to see other people you know get their validation and, and get their readings. I didn't have anyone come through, but that's okay. Maybe we'll do it in the future and maybe something will happen, but yeah, so you guys had been asking me and I wanted to give you guys an update. So it was definitely fun, but I didn't have anyone come through, which is kind of unfortunate, but it's okay. I think if I did, I would have been a little freaked out in a bit anyway. So, so that is my update. So let's go ahead and head to the mall. It's probably gonna be crowded, but I will talk to you guys when I get there. I just got to the mall. Hopefully it will not be crowded and let's see what we can find. I am back at the car. As you could see, there wasn't really too much footage. The stores were so crowded, like Chanel, Louis Vuitton, Gucci. You should have seen the line to get into Gucci. So I did try on a bunch of sunglasses and I actually saw a pair of YSL sunglasses I really wanted, but I thought, Amber, these are very similar to something you already have. You don't need to blow your money on it. So I put them back. I actually tried them on a few times, but I also went into Chanel because I think I mentioned to you guys my birthday is next month and every year for my birthday I definitely like to treat myself to a bag so I tried on the Chanel 19 but I, I'm just still on the fence about the Chanel 19. I think it would be functional but the strap is not as long as I would like like when I put it over my coat so that's one thing and then I also tried on a really pretty caramel boy bag which was really pretty I like that caramel color so I'm still kind of trying to figure out what bag I want to treat myself to so I'm trying to save my money let's see what else but yeah I'm empty-handed I don't have anything that I picked up today so I think what I'm gonna do is I'm actually gonna run into home goods I'm looking for a notebook and if I find one, I'll share that with you. And then later on when I get home, I will share with you what I got for Christmas. So I'll do that in this video at the end of here so you can, so I can kind of tell you guys what I got. But um, I'm going to meet my husband and daughter for Mexican food. I am so hungry, so I might be a little cranky. All I've had today was a coffee and it's two o'clock. That is not healthy, don't do that. But I knew we were gonna eat like an earlier dinner and I just didn't you know, have an opportunity to stop. So I'm gonna run into Home Goods really quick, look for a notebook, go to Mexican, and I will share with you guys what I got for Christmas when I get home.
Okay guys, it is later on in the day. I can't remember where I left off. I think that I left off with going to Home Goods. I didn't end up finding a notebook I liked and then I ended up going to a nail salon really quick. I had like a short amount of time before I had to meet my husband and daughter and I ended up getting sparkly nails for New Year's Eve and I feel like I should not have done this rush job because I didn't end up getting a manicure. I just did a polish change. So you can see when they, when you just get a polish change, they don't do your cuticles and everything too. So I don't know. It might've been a mistake, but it's okay. But I got sparkly nails for New Year's. Not that I'm doing anything on New Year's, but I like to get uh, sparkly nails, but I thought that I would share with you guys what I got for Christmas. Now, I did mention earlier in the video that I did get a little bit of money from my grandma and a little bit of money from my parents. Not a lot, but I was going to go to the mall today and put it towards something, but the mall was so crowded. And honestly, you guys, there wasn't anything that I really, really wanted and I didn't want to waste my money. So I thought what I would do is put that money aside and I would kind of help save up for my birthday in January. Now, I did mention that I'm kind of trying to figure out what bag I want to get for my birthday. I really like the Chanel 19, but when I did try it on in store, it was a little shorter than I thought it was. Like I thought the strap was a little longer and I'm like, if I got the Chanel 19, do I want it in black? Do I want to get a caramel color? Do I even want the Chanel 19? Because honestly, every time I am about ready to pull the trigger on the Chanel 19, something ends up happening where I, I just end up not getting it. So I do think it would be a functional bag, but I just, I don't know. I don't know if it's the right bag for me. So I'm still trying to figure out which bag I want to get for my birthday. So I thought I would share with you what I did get for Christmas. Now, my husband and I at Christmas time, a lot of times we invest in our daughter, our friends and our family, you know, obviously Mr. Banks too. So for each other, we might get each other a couple little things we need, but we definitely don't go overboard. So I have a couple of things that I wanted to share that they got me. They're very thoughtful gifts and they're things I can use and I love them. So the first thing I think I mentioned in one of my vlogs, I had gotten the little ornament from Starbucks and they got me this cup. I wanted this cup. It is so cute. It is like iridescent. I can use it for my water. And then on the inside of the cup, they actually put a little Starbucks gift card. You guys know how much I love Starbucks. So I would just add this to my app on my phone. So I thought this was so thoughtful because when I did bring home the ornament, my daughter kind of looked at my husband like, you know, with like a little grin. And my husband told me later that she had been wanting to get me this cup. So I thought that was so thoughtful. I'll definitely use that. Okay, then my husband knows how much I love Skims and I've been working from home, so I love their loungewear. So he actually got me this. Skims Henley in the most beautiful like burnt orange color. I currently have it in black and then I have um, pink and a couple other colors, but I really liked this burnt orange color. I thought it was so pretty and I will insert an overlay so you can see me trying it on. So I thought that was really, really pretty. These are comfy and they're really stretchy and I like to wear them with joggers or leggings. They're just nice and casual. And then you can throw a sweater or a jacket over top. So I really, really liked this color. The one I really want is cobalt blue, but there's a wait list for it. So, but I love this color, I thought it was different. So my husband got me that. And then the big present, the one that I'm so excited about is we are actually going skiing soon. And I had a jacket. It was like a pink and gray jacket. And I will try to find it and insert a picture. I had that jacket for like 10 years. And last year, the zipper eventually busted. And I knew, oh no, I'm going to have to throw it away. I didn't want to because I love that jacket. But I knew it was time to get a new jacket. So I ended up getting this one. It's so pretty. It's like purple and gray. Let me try it on for you. Hold on. Okay, so here is the jacket. It is purple and gray. Now, I do currently have gray snow pants, but I can't decide if the gray will look better or if I should get black. I already have gray, but my grandma had given me an Amazon gift card. So I went on Amazon and I really wanted to get some of those bib snow pants. So I ordered some black bib snow pants. I think they were like 30 bucks. And then I also got some black ski socks as well with my Amazon gift card. So I already have like a black beanie and then I do have some goggles too. So I just loved the pattern. Isn't this pretty with like the purple? They did have one I really wanted. It was like turquoise, 
a couple years ago, but that is sold out and it has yet to come back. But I really like that one, but the purple is a really good one too. My husband got me this and I thought it was super sweet, but it was a really nice Christmas. I also got my husband, he wanted a new pair of running shoes. He needed some t-shirts. He needed, what else? He wanted a new hat, so I got him new hat. So you know, we got each, we always get each other really like functional gifts or things that we need. We never really buy each other luxury because his philosophy is, I'm not gonna buy you a handbag or an SLG because if you want it, you usually go out and buy it for yourself and he's right. And plus I've told you guys that I personally just feel kind of guilty if he were to buy something like that for me because I do go out and buy it myself and it is really expensive. So I just kind of like to buy things like that for myself. So anyway, I had a really, really good Christmas. These are the items that I got from Sky and Day. Oh, I also got some C's candy and a couple other little things, but these are kind of the main things that I really, really enjoy. So I'm going to let you go now. I'm going to head to the gym. The gym actually wasn't open this morning, but it is open now. So I'm going to head to the gym now and I'm going to sign off here. But I hope you guys had a wonderful Christmas. And if you have any video requests, make sure to leave it down below. I do plan on doing a favorites video coming up very soon, sharing with you guys all of your favorites from the past month. I know you like to see that. So thank you guys again for watching. Have a wonderful day and I'll see you in my next video. Hold up, I am on my way, I'm in motion Let's go to the ocean Yeah, let's go outside We can hang out on the beach with our free